and welcome. Now this is going to be a very short, it's sort of update video. It's a golf clap video. It's Good Friday. My God. Today in retail in malls, it's just hell. That expression sums it up. Hell in the Metro Centre. Why do people go to the Metro Centre like, like on Good Friday, man? My God, it's just chaos. But it's worth going in today. I seen Action Jackson finally giving the Action Jackson VHS. I've had for ages, so he's finally got that. Dan Percy was asking if I had anything terminated. I was like, hey, Dan, I'm sure I've got the Mega Drive now. I've got Mega Drive games all the way up there. You can't really see it because of Bray Wyatt, Krampus, and Sub Zero. But I've got a few Mega Drive games. I've just realised I've got two copies of Aladdin, actually. These are two handy. Boom, what there? Hey, Mitch, remember the time? Fucking Toe Jam and Earl. There's another one. Anyway, um, Dan Percy wanted to trade terminate. I was like, well, what do I want now? I've got a couple of videos coming out and talking about the last quick update video I did. Um, the new baboonery, which I'm going to tell you now, is called Yes to Jericho, Y2J, has been put on hold still. It's grey, in it? It's got something about this new baboonery. It's pretty grey. A little bit grey. So the new baboonery for the four-way movie review, which is like Char, Shin Godzilla, is going to come out before that one. So if there's anything before that, fucking I don't care. I'm doing this video now as well, and the video's like, the pop, new pop vinyl video has not come out with Skeletor and He-Man. He-Man's not in it, Paul Ray's in it, um, Sub-Zero's in it. That's going to come out, and there's, lo there's another baboonery, there's two good to bad what the fuck's film. The Condog video is nearly finished, I hope. Ed 290, the fucking duck has moved again. But yeah, i got Skeletor, an upcoming video, He-Man couldn't resist him, he's absolutely awesome, but he's very, very light. And, unfortunately... Like, these mustn't have done that well because they're on sale straight away. So I told Dan Percy, he got me a Masters of the Universe one because I'm on a buying ban because my birthday is coming up and I said I can't buy anything. She's, like he said, get us one of them and you can have a straight swap. So from $12.99 to $7.99, straight swap for Terminator um, on Mega Drive. Still boxed as well, you know. I've got Beastman. Who is absolutely awesome to have. Now, I do have Beastman, the action figure with Annie Givers. So that is the original Beastman without his armour and his furly halo. I do have Battle Cat. I did think they were going to do a Battle Cat. Battle Cat would look like awesome as a pop fighter. I don't know if it's exclusive anywhere, so you can stay next to the Hellboy gang there. But yeah, comes with a whip inside. Let's have a quick look. Uh, Beastman. He will live outside the box with Skeletor. Um, it's Snake Mountain I'm going to create up there. Should have really pointed the Snake Mountain, it doesn't make any sense if you don't know what's outside the room. Watch other videos, like, subscribe, you're just watching this random video. Which, you probably think, what the fuck's this guy doing with Gremlins 2? Because of the artwork and the title of this is Gremlins 2 Nez. Obviously I'm giving away what's coming next, but in the meantime, Beastman. He is mint, actually, Dan. He's a lot more heavier, fully opposable. A lot of the pub finals now will come like whack ahead, it's like wobble wobble. Little wobble in the deck, wobble wobble. But yeah, he's absolutely mint. Blue pants, like the original. No whip with you. But I mean, what I always remember about this beast, man. Proper squidgy head. Proper squidgy head, but yeah. Absolutely awesome. Thanks very much, Dan. Beast man. Skeletor. He man. Fucking poor here. So beast man, beast man, I have got a Brandon DiCamillo set. Yes, I know who Brandon DiCamillo is before you say anything. I do have CKY4 somewhere, and it's signed by Ryan Dunn. So really, like, know where that is. But yeah, anyway, beast man. Now, one other thing I did get today was Hustle and Flow for a shocking 50 pence. Wow, Hustle and Flow is a hell of a movie. Um, I've seen it a couple of years back, and I was absolutely blown away by it. It's been discontinued for a while, so I picked up Hustle and Flow. Okay, I've seen this, and I couldn't resist it. Now, I do have a NES somewhere. Got the N64 somewhere, the NES somewhere. The lights are all set up, so I'm not going to go and dig them out and go, Hey, look at this. No, nothing's handy. So there's just been a jump cut. Bottom corner right there, I'm talking about a bottle of ale. Bottom corner right there, I'm talking about a bottle of coke. You think, what the fuck? I thought, what the fuck? So, you finished there? Finish it? Right, get rid of that. Right, what I was about to say before I went on a massive rant, I forgot even where it was. Gremlins 2, Nez, cartridge. Now it's got on the back, I paid £6 for it. I would prefer it with a box and even like a case to put it in, but I've seen it in the shop window and could not resist it. Now, obviously, I'm a massive fan of the Gremlins. Gizmo is switched off. Yes. Completely gooned it. I think you can just sort of see stripes here up there and mohawk over there. And there's gremlins everywhere, but having that in the awards, awards my, in my collection was awesome because of this, what Annie got us last year. This is based off the NES game itself, so it's awesome to have them two together, which you'll probably just really look on the shelf now you see this in the background. Gremlins 2, the new batch, action figure, Mohawk, is the body of the game, and it's based off the computer game. And I mean, I'm absolutely loving the bits. You know, he's absolutely awesome, sorry the lights shine there. 
coloured all that. It's absolutely awesome. So this is the still. We see the video. This is the still. You're going to see right now. Now it's probably about right. Gremlins too. I should have that way. No, definitely Gremlins too. <laughs> um, yeah, I remember playing the game when I was a kid. You're going through Gremlins, all the uh, the fucking air vents and all that, and fighting it up and getting your whole Rambo crossbow and all that. It's an absolutely awesome game. It's awesome to have that. So this has just been a random video. Very random. Got a lot of stuff to do. And I've also got to film that. Retro videos. And it looks like a baboon. So yeah. I'm going to film another video with Yes as well. Yes as well for the Magic Eye 2. Found this before. Fuck my life. This is a fucking very old book. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Goodbye. This is now take for the update video. I might have forgotten my pop final video that I had Slimer. Pop final. Which I think is one of the my favourite pop finals. He was down there in limbo, but yeah. Thanks for watching. I fucking duck again. Goodbye.